Today I'm doing a comparison between my distortion pedals to see which one actually has the best sound. Um, I picked the few here that I feel are the best that I've reviewed on my channel. So I've taken a good choice of my pedals and these are the best I think of the distortion ones. Um, and I've gone from like really budget ones to more higher end pedals. And I've gone through the different ranges of makes. This is Electro Harmonics, there's the MXR, there's the Dan Electro, there's the Digitech. I'm also adding this Dime Distortion, which was a bit more expensive than the rest of them. Um, to be fair though, when I reviewed it originally, some of the sounds on this was horrible. And it was just like, I couldn't possibly put that out because no one's going to sit and listen to that. But it also does have some great tones as well. So I am adding that I've one. I've got the Bus, Metal Zone and I've got the blood drive here as well, this coffee one. Yeah, I've got the original Metal Zone, but I've gone for the new one. Personally, I don't think there's a massive difference in sound. I know people have done comparisons on it, but I am gonna use the newer one because it has got slightly more tones to it. So that's the one I'm gonna use with that. I've got the two distortions here as well for this MXR. I've got the Distortion 3 and the Distortion Plus. I prefer the Distortion Plus, so I'm gonna go with that one. And with this Electro Harmonics one, I'm going to use this slightly dearer one here than the Pocket one. But I do think they're both fantastic sounding. But, you know, this one has, again, has got slightly more range on it. So I'm going to go with that one. Now I have decided to add this Dan Electro Black Licorice. Um, it's one of the smaller pedals that they do and it is more of a budget pedal. But imagine this one because I reviewed it and even though people have said the review was good, a lot of people have said it's a horrible sound. So putting it up against other distortions, we can actually see if it is a horrible sound or just people were just saying it's a horrible sound. So I'm going to put that one in and like I say, it is more of a budget pedal, it is the cheapest one here. So these are the distortion pedals I've decided to put against each other. Now the metal zone here is the one I normally use when I'm playing with my band and I'm recording music. So that's the one I've normally used. If I want a distortion sound, that's the one I go for. A lot of people say it just sounds like a bee buzzing, but I've really liked it. So winter's coming and hopefully my band will start producing some music again. And who knows, one of these pedals might shine above the boss metal zone for me. So I do realise trying to play every single sound that every single pedal can make and trying to compare that is unrealistic. So what I'm going to do is find the best sound in my opinion on every pedal, play the same riff through each pedal, and then when they're being played through that pedal, I'll put them on the screen so you can see which one's being played, which one's making that sound, and then compare them that way. And I feel that's the best way of doing this. So I'll find the best sound and then we'll take a look. The guitar I'm using is my Fender Nocaster, and the pedals are going straight into my Tascam mixer desk.
they are some of the sounds from some of my distortion pedals and in my opinion these electro harmonics have come on top however there's always a bigger fish